All new tonight, a parking problem at HPD's Alapai headquarters. Chief investigative reporter Lynn Kowano has exclusive video showing a garage overloaded with vehicles connected to crimes. The video is eye opening. The employee parking garage at Alapai is also being used to store vehicle evidence, and that's delaying officers from getting on the road. About 80 vehicles marked as evidence fill level P2, the secure employee lot of HPD's main station. The recently added cars are double parked and take up one full driving lane. The older vehicles are covered in dust and take up the parking stall. Officers have to wait until the previous watch leaves to get a spot. The police are saying that they need more people on the road, but th if this could cause a bottleneck. The department says most of the evidence cars are connected to violent crimes, including homicides. They're being stored at the request of the prosecutor's office, but defense attorneys say that's not necessary. I've never had a car, actual car used as evidence in any of the cases that I've had. They put pictures and things of that nature, so I don't know why you'd need to keep the car, the whole car anyway. You can photograph it, process it. But what they could do very easily is just discuss the issue with the defense attorney, make it available. Parking problems have always been an issue for HPD officers, but it's worse now. In a statement, the prosecutor's office says evidence, including vehicles, is important to successful prosecutions, and the department is working with HPD to reduce inventory without compromising the integrity of criminal cases or public safety. Legal experts point out evidence from other crimes aren't seized for such a lengthy period of time shoplifting cases. They used to take the item that was concealed and hold it until the trial, until finally they passed the statute that says no, they can just take pictures of the items. They're preserving the evidence. HPD says they are now doing monthly inventory checks and they are trying to get vehicles deemed abandoned, towed out of the structure. We asked the prosecutor's office and HPD for updates as they work through the problem with the parking situation. We'll follow up. I'm Lynn Kawano, Hawaii News Now.